I didn't see you there. You caught me in a bad time. I was reading. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> we know I don't read. Welcome to the channel. It's your boy. Bum, bum, bum. Sound effects. <laughs> Can't afford it. It's okay. I got it next time. But you guys, time to get serious. I'm going to keep this short. Get to the point. Say what I think. Don't want to offend anybody. If I do, I do apologize. I ain't trying to offend nobody. But this video is about the Black Lives Matter protests slash riots. So we went to downtown Dallas. This was not not very... We weren't planning for this, but it eventually happened. This is the weekend when it first started with the protests slash riots. I also just protest because the riots are just like... It went ace out of hand, especially when you had cops and people who were like mad at the cops. Or just, just injustice within the cops and the, you know the whole system. So pretty much this video, we were just there checking it out. I was made with some friends. We um, talked earlier about heating up some place to go to shoot. Plans changed and we ended up going through a protest. It was pretty cool. Um, we did get in the protest for a little bit. But just to get a breather because of my beautiful assistant partner. I had to take a side so we stepped away from there. And with my friends that we went with, we got separated. But we went around, saw like pretty much the damage, the vandalism of just of the riots and the protests. And just to give my thoughts on the protests, you know, it was it was beautiful. You know, people were there handing us water, making sure we were okay, even though we weren't over there chanting or like being full blown to it, even though we support it. Even though we don't I was I personally don't support the riots. And especially because right now it's a bad time. You got the corner riots, you got people who are struggling. And you got people who are mad. So with those two combining, you know, something was going to happen. So that was the result. And it's happening worldwide, not just the United States, you know, other countries too, within their own system. So it's a worldly thing and it's beautiful to have we're coming together as one. So I'm very excited for the future, how we hold ourselves as a society and as people. And hopefully this nonsense will stop and we can all learn to live and respect each other, you know, that's all That's all it is we have to do, you know. It's simple, but it's hard too, so, because we're complicated people. But anyways, we got separated with our friends, so we just went around, saw all the vandalism, vandalism. and this was then when we had our curfew, so we had to leave at 7. I had to get to the car to 7.30. My friends, since we got separated, were protesting, and when, right when 7-ish happened, they got tear gas. And my friend lost her phone and wallet. Thankfully, they found it. I don't know how, but they found it. Thank God. And we were safe, so and none of us got um, harmed or any way. But I know I talked more than I was supposed to, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And show your support of people of color, people of different religions, different people ideas. Because we just need to respect each other and learn to love ourselves and others too. So do your job. Also, just to give you guys a heads up, we use washi film. This is film I've never used. If you don't know anything about washi film, it's, it's the world's smallest film company. They do a lot of unique stuff with their film stocks. I have three, but the original film stock W, I messed it up. It's made out of Japanese paper. And you get these really cool um, looks with this film, just because it's on paper. But since it was very delicate, I kind of abused the the film and it pretty much got all caught up with inside and the first 16 shot I originally took got ruined lucky enough I had two more rolls at an F they call it F which is a x-ray film at ISO 100 and then Z which is an infrared at 400 ISO so those are the films that I use the film stock that I use for these two pictures I like both of them I really like the Z the most the F the x-ray is it, it, usually it says on the on the container that you have to take six blank shots just because of fogginess but I had to take more than six so that kind of if um, kind of made some pictures look kind of funny but after you get those shots I really like how contrasty how beautiful these black and white film stocks were and I do plan on using these again for different situations or different lightings so yeah if you guys don't have any in your local shop you can always check them online they're very good film stocks and they have a bunch of unique stuff you want to check them out and you know support you know small businesses
All right, guys, it is Sunday. We're in downtown Dallas taking pictures with my friends over there. Vivian. What's your name again? Jaden. <laughs> we're out here. We're taking pictures. This is the two days after the rides here in downtown Dallas. And hopefully we don't contract any vines around here. We're peaceful photographers doing peaceful things. And hopefully we get some good shots. Let's get it.
since I had more shots left on my last roll, we decided to go to Deep Ellum. Uh, if you don't know, Deep Ellum in Dallas is very, it's like a music-y, arty district, close pretty much to the outskirts of downtown. There used to be like an old jazz scene over there back in the day, but you know, things change, business change, economy, whatever. Yeah, so right now, it's Jennifer over there, they got a bunch of hotels and stuff. And they got the rights when they first started, got to there, and the Poise Skate Shop that recently opened is a skate shop, if you don't know the skate shop, or if you don't know anything about skateboarding, there's a local skate shop. If you have money, you should locally buy them online, just step them out. That's pretty much what they're doing, so starting to go fund me. They just want to do things the old-fashioned way, and all you know, just sell product, make profit, and just, you know, keep the community going. So yeah, if you have a chance. I'll put their link in the description below if you have anything, if you just want to check it out, see what they got. And I appreciate it, and the community appreciates you. But yeah, we went to Deep Ellum. We went over there to check out how the, it was over there. It was pretty calm. We didn't see too much damage. There was a, a bit of vandalism. And, but we were just over there trying to just check it out, see how what, what was up. And just, you know, just waste the rest of the stock just because I wanted to waste it. I was very excited. We really wanted to see these pictures, and I was excited about them. And hopefully you guys enjoyed that part of the section, even though it kind of got mixed in with the Black Lives Matter protest pictures. But anyways, hope you guys enjoy, and you guys stay safe. Peace.